I need some of that Don Chief in there, nigga. Stop playing. I'm gonna have to bless you. I'm gonna have to bless you. I see you coming with something. I'll be showing that love. Check it, man. Check it, check it, check it. It's your boy, he's CEO. I'm here with the lovely, amazing, official Miss Jamaica. What's going on? Not none. You know my dad walk on? Man, hey, man. Listen, man. Hey, man. That man is back, man. This guy right here, man, he really don't need no introduction, man. Uh, you know, if you've been watching the internet lately, man, every situation, man, been popping up, man. We don't know what's going on. I don't know what's happening around here, man. But yeah. it's been high time for me, man. Yeah, the yeah, yeah. Dunn yeah. Chief's in the building. In the building again. Thanks for showing the red carpet love. Man. You know, bosses amongst bosses, you know, and bosses, boss ladies, you know what I'm talking man. about? Man. Boss of friends. So appreciate you for having me come. Through. How's it been, man? Like, like being, this world was one, I know when, when I first met you, here and me and you was just chopping it up you know you was like man you know i really don't mess with this and right, right. you know because you 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 know because of the way things was but things be changing so much man you know it what done, i'm saying it done change like uh you know a, a zero to a hundred real quick real you know quick saying? like you know just a couple months ago wasn't nobody you hear me it wasn't no no chief stir up you know it wasn't nobody rapping you know or, or speaking on me on no on no no, no part in in that case, you know what I'm saying. But you know, just fast forward with 30 days later, now it's just like you hear me. Now I'm just like <laughs> booming like the trap. You did, you know, over some, you know, cap, not rap. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, this ain't even about the rap. It's all about the cap. You dig? And I done got. It's like you know, and it's crazy because I be even talking. You know, like man, you know, Charleston was campaigning for me a whole year and a half. You know, saying I was the best thing since sliced bread. And then soon as he said something crazy, it went viral. You know what I'm talking about? So you know, along with everybody else, you know what I'm saying? So. It's just, it's all cool with me because I just look at it for what it is. It's entertainment, man. You know, it's it's not nothing personal to me. Yeah. But are you capitalizing on all of Most that? Most definitely. To be <laughs> exactly. Uh, I, I, I got about nine, ten thousand new followers. You know, put it like this: for every one or two hates, it's about four or five greats. You know that that congratulate. You know what I'm saying? So you know all the youngsters, whoever they they, they ain't heard of me, they checking for me now. You know what I'm talking about? I'm getting interviews from Detroit. You know, boys letting me know like, nah, we in Vegas. Nah, we heard we mess with you. You know what I'm saying? So it's been nothing but capitalization. On on my end, you know, I'm working and, you know, young boys, young the young bulls that's doing their thing now, they paying for features, man. OG, I want to mess with you. We we didn't even know where you was at. It took for, you know, that's what they say. Like, where you was at? You know what I'm saying? So it's been all uh, groovy my way and I'm, you know, I'm cool with it. Yeah, yeah. Man. I, I I just enjoy it, you know. I see the I see it, man. You know, like I I know what it do. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, we yeah. talked outside last time we finished the interview. Like I know what it, I know what it come with it. You right. know what I'm saying? This is something to where when people start to you know this thing here, it's not a game, man. Like people are seeing you everywhere. You can't take that back, and you're already talented. So at the end of the day, when these people see it, then they got to go research it. Then I see them in the comments. They come back. They be saying, man, I went listening at that. Chief, man, that all went hard. Like right, the certain right, niggas, right, the young right, niggas, right. I know they yeah, just catch, try, they yeah, figuring they it out. They you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, everybody, you know, and I be like, man, I know I ain't for everybody. You know what I'm saying? So I take the ones that don't, but nah, I done caught in with a lot of them. You know, like those who biting their bait. You know what I'm saying? They loving what they done ate. You know what I'm talking Already? about? Already? Yeah. So it's 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 cool. I, I like it. No, nah, I'm, I'm in. Mean, you should. Yeah, they done woke me up. Yeah, I'm I'm with the shit now. I'm here. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I be having yeah. fun. I be seeing you know. Oh, I, I, Big D, shout out to uh, Big D Mogul. Mm -hmm. I, 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 I say okay, you ain't got my boy Chief. Oh nigga. yeah, no, nah, they got hey, me a little flip them. Man. Little, little flip them. I hear me. They like, bro, man, you just like nigga, you amazing, fam. Like, you know, I ain't never take the time to check you out, but like, people been campaigning for you, and like the way you handle yourself on them interviews and how you stick on how you know on what you stand for. You like, man, you just be and how you be looking out. Like, you know, it's been like. 
entertainment that they like. And so I'm like, you know, I'm just being me. This ain't really no facade. Or <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna lie. I enjoy it. Every bit of it, bro, yeah. because I love to see, you know, the, the just, right. the, just do giving, man. Like, just a dope, dope dude, man. The music already, you know, it pretty much permeates to your soul when you really listen to it like I have. Right, right. You know, right. and ain't no take back, nigga, with me. It's what I do. I ain't never been no follower anyway. Right, so right, at right. the end of the day, ain't no take back. Nah, so you can't, take, you can't is, take that nigga. shit back with that being all on the cameras, man. It ain't no take back. It, you Once know, you, you put it out there, yeah. it's out there. Yeah, you know, the good or the bad. You know what I'm saying? So you got to take that. And I'm going to just tell you, boy, go rewind and go look at that shit a little while ago, y'all. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, you know, so nah, nah, I'm with it. I, I'm really enjoying it. I, I, once again, I appreciate you for y'all sharing y'all platform with me. Let me talk my shit and squat and spit a little bit. You know what I'm saying? It's our platform. Yeah. That's the way it go down yeah. over here. Yeah. Like, yeah. they don't realize what's going on with me. Like, it's a little different over here. Like, we be having a damn good time. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. We right. already know right. it's motion over here. Yeah. You know, yeah. nigga, like, damn, man, them niggas, what y'all doing this time? We, we be everywhere. You know what I'm yeah. saying? And then yeah. we be right here, too. Right. So at the end of the day, you're in trouble, nigga. You don't we got no from trouble every but angle. No, you don't got no trouble but to grow. Like, yeah, I, I see you working. I, you like, you like my guy. Uh, you know, I tell anybody like they be in the music, them execs, like yeah. the ones who are willing to get on the road and go oh, out yeah. there. And get, they gonna come back with it the most than the boy just standing in that office. That's right. real talk. You That's real so, talk. Yeah, your your platform. It don't have no no choice but to get big and more people to recognize it because they seeing you here, they seeing y'all there everywhere. So, now and then you 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 know you back at home like. Now, yeah, you spreading you, you spreading that mayonnaise all across that brunette. That's it. But I got a question because I see, like you said, um, you got more subscribers. You out here doing interviews and stuff like that. But I'm not seeing you putting out a lot of posts on your Instagram or on your Facebook or any of your social media. What's up with that? I mean, cause. I don't know, really. I, I'm still trying to get tapped in. Like I, I'm one of them guys. My phone rarely stay in my hand. You know, like you know, I'm I'm the one of the lamest, livest cats around. I don't mess with people. You know what I'm saying? So you know, just having a phone in my hand that really be for business. You know, right. now I'm trying to get acclimated and let this be my business because I see what it's bringing me. You right. know, but I really just be in the real world. But that's the reason why I ask if you're capitalizing on it because you need to capitalize on it on all platforms everywhere, not only just doing interviews, but you need to also benefit from those interviews and not only by getting subscribers, but actually keeping it up on your own platform. Right, right, right. You're right, talking right, about the engagement. Right. You're talking about the engagement. engagement. Because people come into your platform because they want to hear what you guys say. Right. Yeah, but yeah. if you're not posting or doing any lives or going not live. doing anything for them to I hear what... I go live. You know, I seen you go live a few times. I have seen you go live a few times. often. Uh, be on a nigga. She want to go live Listen, every damn day. I, I started. I done been going live, but I probably the I had a birthday weekend, so I was really I was going live, but I yeah, had a I heard about that weekend. Birthday I had a weekend. weekend, so the phone went just in my hand, just you know, like. I'm I'm a really I mean I don't you know that shit. Hire somebody to be around you to do it. Maybe I need to do to that. Film you I every said move. that today. I, but, but you know what I did my film people there. But y'all talking some instant stuff. No no yeah we we talking some instant stuff. I'm talking. Hire a young I'm, kid to have your cell phone and video you. Yeah right, right, all the time. I, I'm not gonna think about it. I'm gonna be. Called, you don't I'm need to. A, I'm gonna be in the in the moment because all the moments you're talking about, they do it how you talk all slick and fly and stuff, and, and you might be just doing something. They be like, man, I should. They gonna love that. it. That person They gonna call. love it Right 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 They already your, your style They watch you man They watch your motion It's content over create That's mm -hmm. what it is People don't realize that But your content That, that, that basically uh, You do Need to be seen Because the creativity People a lot of times Give it too much credit Right In this world we in now The content is so important Because that's your That's like that's your real estate Yeah 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 so the, anything Like you walking through the door right, right. You'll that's see me do a drop Before you leave And all that stuff This is real man That's where you That's that's going that, that equates to money Fact. And people don't realize That as mm -hmm. much now There's people walking around Like the country Wayne's Who I be sitting with uh, or, or Mike Bliss uh, or, or Jordan Jackson, who was here last week, these guys uh, four hundred thousand a month mm. behind content, and it ain't no content that's predicated over uh, we gonna do this over the the week. Mm -hmm. This is stuff on a whim. A nigga touch a nigga's stomach. Right, uh, a girl right. touching. You know what I'm saying? Right, this is weird right. stuff that you wouldn't know. Uh, uh, Carlos Miller say he tried to put a pizza in his mouth, and it did millions of views. He just trying to put a pizza in his mouth. Right. 
Right. right. You know, mm-hmm. That's a lot of money. Right. Because you never know what's going to go. But at the same time, you got to hit it while you're relevant, while yeah. people are looking for you. Well, while, while you're working. People, while you're working. Right. right. Yeah. That's when you want to hit it. And the reason I say that, because I was just talking to a dude about you and went off on him, too. Hound at that nigga. I hope you see this nigga. <laughs> Hound at that nigga because, he, you know, he was trying to tell me about, you know, I, I'm back on that age ain't nothing but a number, but I'm not on that uh, a Leo, you know what I'm saying? But, mm-hmm. Right, right. But, but I'm being real. You In this world, it's not about your age. Right, right. Nobody gives a damn. It, it, you could be anywhere in this world and somebody like you right. when you're on this on this right here on this pla- yeah on this platform. I don't I can look and and see that some damn body in Africa like me in the analytics you right. know what I'm being I'm being real nobody give a damn about people like man man Dallas ain't gonna ride with this or they ain't gonna ride with that they might not but who cares if if, if I hit somewhere else I'm being real that's right. why I do it the way I do it I can't limit myself bro so that's why I say like. When you tell me Don Chief, he he, yeah, that's an old rapper. I don't ride with that because people are looking at content. They right. don't give a damn. You talented, right? Right. If you put the content out and do the work and do the visuals, it's a rap. That's money. See, when I be you understand what I'm saying? When, that's money. When I hear people be on that old talk, that be them people that done gave up. Yeah. Oh, you you old nigga for what you were trying to do. You dig? I ain't too old for what I'm doing. You dig? I'm still groovy. You too old for what you trying to do, and you looking at things in the old man or older perspective. Like, nah, you can't put that jacket on me, Jack. You know what I'm saying? Age just state of mind. You know what I'm talking about? I agree. So you know, I just feel like when people be like, "Oh, you too old," nah, them, them, you the boys who done gave up. Y'all ain't got y'all. Whatever it is that you was trying to do, you got too old for it. Yeah, yeah. I think because, because um I know recently Rainwater came on here and he was like a lot of these old rappers need to sit down and do um and start their own labels. So That's that cool too. so that they can help these young cats coming up and put them in place and teach them what they know and learn from them as well. But that's cool too, but this ain't just a young people world. It's gr- why you think Earth Wind and Fire are still <laughs> Tune. Why you think a ball him? No, cause it's a hundred million grown people too, and they'll be willing to spend their money on quality. So I catch that. That's cool. It's a young man game, but now the older people is still tuning. You still, man. They finna have genuine, genuine them went viral just by doing moves. <laughs> and them no, dance. you dig? So it's like. I don't get their logic. I th- I, I'm going off logic. Like, okay, you think people just went stop listening to music because they get older? They don't. Mm. They stop going to concerts because they get older. They stop enjoying life. Now, when they get something that's catered to them, grown people go, you know, the older people is going to rock out with it. You know what I'm saying? So I'm cool with, you know, reaching down and, and pulling up the young bulls and, you know, giving them game and, and, and whatever a, a, a assistance I can give. But, you know, boys just talking about a nigga. Like, like he ain't, he he obsolete anyway. Like, real talk, you got to make somebody, little bro. Like, you ain't, nigga, Mo wrapped his way. You ain't did enough for the run. Little, little bro, them over there, they quit you. You know what I'm saying? Then you ain't, you done went out of town. Like, you know, you giving the Mo three verses away. You can't get clearances on. So it's like, you did... I don't really just be tripping on what he be talking about, but it's not just a young people game. You know, grown people listen to music, too. So, you know, they the ones who get these tools, too. Who no. you be seeing coming through? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You see them coming through, though. No, dude. Juvie them rocking. Yeah. They coming. Kiki them, they, they rocking. They don't, you know, so it's like, you know, I get it, but they just disregard that other money. Yeah, yeah. I, I think, and, and, and it's... It can be two rights, too. Mm-hmm. Meaning, the young folks are doing their thing. They always have. Right, right. And the older folks still doing their thing. That's what a platform, like I tell people a lot of times, I say, this is a grown, you got to be grown. This platform, you get grown. Now, this, what, this ain't nothing to play the with. The younger cats going to be looking yeah. at me. Now nah, they going to look at me because I got a CD still, and I be like, nah, but it's somebody that I fuck with that is going to pay me $10 for that boy. That's they going to look at that and be like, man, that nigga still got CD trying to sell them boy, this or that. You know, but because they ain't never, they just, you know, they just don't get it. <laughs> Funny he it's said that because that's what Ray wanted to say. No, but Ray wanted to say that nigga got a CD. He put. He said, "Nigga, I got my CD." But, but he don't even no. know how much money I made just 
people just like you got a CD on you, bro, because that's what they know. They, it's they, the support. That's all they're doing. Because when you say that, who I think about is Pimpin' Kid. Pimpin' Kid doing the same still thing. Still have the DVDs given out, and nobody really have DVD players no more. And but I people got still all be these buying damn DVDs from him. What it's just the support. Just, and, 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 that's and, all and, it is. You know, <laughs> you know how much you know. You can walk. You can go across <laughs> this whole region, and you can bump into a thousand people that's just willing to support you for that ten dollars. Right. So you add that ten dollars times that thousand. See, I'm a logic. I rather make. I rather sell two. Three thousand CDs for that ten five to ten dollars to get two hundred views, two hundred thousand views. Yeah, yeah. But you talking about logics? My brain work like this. Why not do that? Both. I know what you about to say. Just like how you talk about, yeah, you catering to the old folks. Definitely got to bring up the young folks, and you definitely, you know, should do a label because you have a lot of knowledge, knowledge and you have a lot of experience and stuff like that. But then I also think about with Faison and the new wave. Yeah, we just shout so out it goes it goes both ways in the movie industry compared to the music industry. You have to do both ways. Why not do both ways and earn even more money doing I mean, what I'm you do? I'm work. with you. I'm just saying, like me, just like if if I gotta choose, I'm gonna choose to get that money. That I want that I want you can buy up front money. The, yeah, these two three thousand mm. CD for the ten dollars. I ain't trying to like get a like. I don't care about that. Just if I had to, if it's just like chief, you would never blow viral. Be digital. Well, I'm cool. If I can sell, if I can still skate around here and sell three four thousand CDs at that five ten on some. Hey man, I'm just supporting you. That's groovy to me. Yeah, I think it's it. Like I said, I always say, and I got to be real with both instances. You can be right. At the same time, mm -hmm. you see what I'm saying? And I think a lot of times that's where people get caught and lost in the sauce because it can be two rights. And, and, and at the end of the day, I'm, yeah, I do. I, I've always just try to do everything. And a lot of times you limit yourself doing that too. Right. You know right, what I mean? Right. So uh, not focusing on the one thing, you know, but there's a chemistry, man. Like I said, if you can build and know how to delegate real well, you got to deal with people. Yeah, there, here we go again. They hard headed as hell. Mm -hmm. You know how many people been hired there over the last fifteen years, mm -hmm. and other stores. It's just a hard, especially dealing with young people, where you know oh, it's they hard, have to bro. try to learn your way, and you have to try to learn their way. Right, you know right, what I right, mean? Right. It ain't easy. It's not. No, just mm -hmm. like it wasn't easy for the older ones to learn our way. Dang right. Mm -hmm. That's right. You remember? I yeah. talk, I don't know if I said it on here with you, but I was like, man, we took our our parents from uh, Marvin Gaye to. Uh, Luke, hey, we want some, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah for sure. <laughs> like, yeah. It was a hell of a spin for us. Right. I, I seen rap come in. I'm an old cat. Right. So I seen it when it came, you know what I'm saying? And when it came, it was harsh. It wasn't playing, you know, it wasn't playing with them. With, and they was like, what? Right, we right. I can't believe yeah, this. Yeah, you know? yeah, 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 jaw dropping. <laughs> yeah, how, yeah. How, how's he greeted being uh, the yeah. the show, the podcast? Man, you know what? I ain't been doing uh, nothing. My guy, my guy passed away, man. Whoa. That was filming for me, man. Rest in peace, Cortez, Sorry man. Sorry to hear. Uh, so... That's kind of through yeah. a little, little monkey wrench off into it. You know, like I still got episodes that's on this computer. You know what I'm saying? Wow. Yeah. If, if you yeah. need some help from me, you let me know. Yeah, so. Uh, oh, I'm a guru. Yeah, we ain't, this, huh? yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> you know, I'm and I'm just letting the family kind of take their time. Mm -hmm. I ain't just, I ain't tripping. You know what yeah. I'm saying? So, right. yeah, that's just on that. So once I catch another groove, I got plenty. You know, I'm going to have y'all. I'm going to reverse the time. Y'all going to come in my world. Damn you know right, we're coming. And I'm going to make the ladies some food. Make Oh man, yeah, I'm coming in here. Yeah, oh, by man. the way, you, are you the one who cook? Of course not. <laughs> <laughs> he said, of course not. Of course not. I you thought know, you was going to say yeah. No, that's my guy GD, man. He greeted boy GD, professional, licensed chef. You know what I'm talking about? You know, he been here. He been cooking, you know, on his own journey. But he been always somebody who always reached out like, hey, man, chef meal, some meal prep. You know, that's my, yeah, that's my guy. He good. He good. Yeah, he like, he love what he doing. So it always come out, you know, groovy. Well, let me ask you about that. I, and, and this something that's going to get into the music a little bit. I'm going to go there. Uh. Hold your tongue, man. Like, I know when I talked to Mr. Pookie, he said you had came with that song. Um, like, how did you, being such so young, how did you end up even doing that? You already was making a lot of music? Yeah, it was just one of them ones that was in the notebook. Like, I so back when I was younger, I used to rap without the beat. So, okay. I just used to have a tablet full of number rap. You know what you? I'm saying? How old were you at the time? Uh, you know, uh, that probably... Uh, 17, 16, 17, 18. It, it was like, because I just had got out of high school once we had, once we had, goddamn, we got a, together. Who was that dude they always used to talk about, the one that was over A or 
Kevin A. Kevin A. Yeah, Kevin A. Now, so so basically, did you link? You knew him or? No, nah, see, I was rapping with Pimpster. Okay. And uh, Pimpster had a homeboy named C Dog. If okay. anybody knows C Dog, then they know who C Dog is. C Dog was rapping too. So, but he knew I was with Pimpster. So he went and he fucked with Kevin A. Now. So he told Kevin A. Hey man, Pimpster got a young nigga over there that'll go right with these boys and wooty woo. Just gave me my spiel and you know I met them boys over there off Northwest Highway and that's how we met. I met really through C Dog. Okay. C Dog introduced me and Kevin A. I was, I mean, because you you said hold your tongue because I might say something I might not, I may say something you might not like, um, like like how did you come up with it? Just how did you come up with those those? Man, I was young, just just got. I, I don't I, I don't think I think that's in a scripture. Or something. I don't know. I I was just on some young shit, just you know, just writing, man. <laughs> yeah, right. I want to be like Bone. That was the Bone era, cause I was yeah, singing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold your tongue. Yeah. You like, yeah, that was the Bone era. So I was trying to mo murder, mo murder. Yeah, you trying to get that over? <laughs> Yeah, that was that thuggish, ruggish ball yeah. every time. So, she, that, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, it was just something that just came up out of there. Man, uh, shout out to the nigga that I just checked because he said he ain't never hear a uh, uh, Big Chief and uh, Oak Cliff nigga when we were riding. We went Big T nigga, Cap at the Bomb, couldn't play nothing else, nigga. Oh, <laughs> man, Cap at the Bomb, goddamn, he is the shit. That's one of the reasons Oak Cliff <laughs> loved me. That's how went hard in there. Yeah, that's one of the reasons the Cliff <laughs> fucked with me the long way because Cap kept that music playing through there, him and Don. Every and day, yeah, every day. Yeah. I go in there on the weekends when yeah. I get out of work. As soon as I get in there, I'm working in there and ain't getting paid. Shout out to Daniel and Hakeem for working the hell out of me for nothing back in the days. But anyway, when I would be in there, I knew when the E Greedy value was coming out, go Cap gonna give it Say, to me I all day, nigga. Game. Nah, them boys used to treat my shit like, hey, we go have them. They used to drop give like nigga, we gonna have them. They it dropped Friday, but I can give them to you Wednesday. Like yeah. come back. Nah, that's how that's they play with that chief, man. Yeah. The E Greedy values. Nah, I don't fuck what nigga talking about. <laughs> Nah, I was that cocaine through here, man. <laughs> nah, nah, I was that cocaine through here. Like, like I paid bills around here. I know. Nah, stores may pay their bills off of them e greedy value. Oh, I know. I know. Them things went hard. George, too. Man, George was the one now. who was helped distributing, putting it in places where I never been. Cause yeah. you know they politicking with each other, so he like, you know, I'm wondering, hey, how they got me in Oklahoma? They be like, you know, you know, Joy Lopez, you know, they shipping them all. You got James and Ergasms, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, they was really goddamn because they was putting mixtapes together, making their own money. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah, I'm selling it to them. Yeah, they popping it to them folks for thirteen fifty. Man, they were treating me like Jay Z. Damn. Now nah, they, they, they loved nah, they, you. Nah, $20. I loved nah, it. Nah, $20. I'm not, I'm not no low. Now nah, they sixteen ninety nine to me like I'm, I got a deal. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, I, and I loved every minute of it. What you got? Okay, I want to get into this. Um, oh, you want to get into yes. it? Yes. I want to know. So you had your birthday thing down by Tyler, right? How did you end up down there in Tyler on your, your birthday? No, nah, my birthday was the eighth, so I just okay. did a whole week, week Sunday okay. to Sunday. You know, I had the old Cliff Club that Wednesday, then I okay. had some that Thursday and Friday. You know, so Sunday was just pretty much the finale. You know, where the bread was at. So, but yeah. why choose Tyler? Because he had already came here. Mm. And Tyler is one of my markets too, but you know, like you know, right now with him being a hot artist, you know what I'm saying? Like we just move, you know, go move around. But Tyler is, you know, that's done chief backyard. That big, they chief backyard too, though. Okay, so yeah. this is this was your shindig. This is your oh no, event. this is me, this is me. Yeah, this so me. you hired him to be on your show with you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I paid him. Okay, yeah, I'm the one who paid him. Yeah, okay, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. So. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. He was, yeah, you know, I fuck with him. Come on, let's go eat a little bit. Come party with me. You know what I'm saying? So you that's you had told was. me about that. Uh, you had told me about that um, weeks, week, a month right, when right. we interviewed the first right, time that right. it was going down. And um, I was excited about it, but I knew I would be out of town. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I knew, I knew you were getting down. I knew you were Yeah, I yeah, you. DeVille and them showed me love. I was, yeah, you know, it was just, been, it was a wonderful week. Like, I ain't celebrated a birthday in over like seven years, you know what I'm mm. saying? So it was all groovy just to get the love, you know what I'm saying, and people to come out. You know, the night was, you know, a good success. You know, the city was out. Tyler fucked with a nigga. They, you know, they was in there. 
That's East Texas love, yeah, man. Yeah. You always have one down there. And yeah, I'm a stay Show going. love, nah, man. I'm a stay show going. love. This Texas, man. Yeah, That's I'm what stay going. I started wearing my cowboy hat because I thought niggas <laughs> were and my Emmy Smith jersey and all my I bring mean. my boots up here, nigga. Yeah, Snake skin yeah. boots. Yeah. Put the stick back in my yeah, mouth, yeah, nigga. Yeah, huh, These niggas right. don't know who they dealing with. It's a real Texas thing for me. Hey. So you know when I look at yeah, it's real Texas, nigga. I might go fishing after this. I don't know, nigga. Or ride a horse. We don't know. But at the end of the day, what you ain't gonna do is play with us. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. We ain't gonna be playing. We cause that's just they're just talking to Texas. You yeah, know yeah, saying? yeah. You know what? What really? You know, you when you think about it, you look at you know the way the show was going, what hit the waves because you done went viral again. Mm -hmm. Basically, I get all these texts. I was texts. shocked when I, I saw it. Lie, I'm gonna tell you what happened to me. I uh I was sitting there at the uh at the house yesterday, and I my phone I. You know, we had just got back from out of town, so my phone was going crazy all day. I never did check it because I was working on on other stuff. And uh, then last night hit, and and I got these calls, man. I kept getting these calls and videos today. Right. And I'm like, man, what the hell happened down there? You know what I'm saying with uh with Chief down there in East Texas. And then I seen your Big D, and I'm like, nigga, what are you doing on there? That boy came over here first, nigga. I'm the one. What the hell? You know, nigga get a little jealous. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, this territorial. Nigga. Yeah, I said, this nigga supposed to be on Boss Talk. I called there. Uh, man, nigga, what's going on? My nigga, why my nigga over there? What's going on? Dig it, dig it, dig it. Yeah, he, like, yeah, he, call, yeah, he, was, he called while nigga was on the road going down there. He like, let's get one in. I was like, cool, let's go. You know, I mean, no, and, and I honestly, it. that was he. That was before the, 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 the show. The, the show. Oh, really? wow. Before the show. He was like, when I was going down there Thursday and Friday, he was like, hey, let's get yeah, another he one Yeah, he chill. Yeah, yeah, that was before the show. Yeah, okay. I, I came on back from my town, but when I get back, I see, I, I see finesse. Is it two times finesse, finesse two, two times? Time. Yeah, he, I see him with the angry face on. Right, yeah. right, 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 right. He's upset. He's, Mean he's, buggy he's, like he's, he about yeah. to do something. And and he's very upset. And he looking and he looking and I see him. Then he walk out. Then a dude in a cowboy's jersey walk out. Okay, and he say some. To uh, the dude in the dreads, yeah, and then uh, the dude in the dreads say something back. Then, then he come back again, and it wasn't really no that didn't look too you know what I mean that looked kind of normal to me, but it's still yet and still after they y'all y'all situated yourself, uh, I think it was yeah from there say cut that shit off or something like that, and uh, but when he said it. I don't. I wasn't there, so I don't know. I, but it seemed flagrant as hell. Were you performing at the time when he said that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I couldn't hear him. I didn't hear him. You know, like the guy with the dreads had the bike. We was on the. You know, he was talking. So I was. I was in party mode. I was in perform mode. I wasn't focused on nothing else. Right. So he sounded like shit G Hood with the mic. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. In the music. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So it really wasn't nothing that I caught. I caught it just like everybody else the next day. You know what I'm saying? They be like, man, I was like, shit, I ain't heard that shit. You know, and then my guy who y'all talking about in the jersey, that's my guy money, you know, uh uh my way turn way. He yeah. got his motion going. So, you know, they was his he was their point man with him with him, you know, they having a uh affiliation. So he was their point man. So he wasn't he was just like, you know, hey man, uh uh, he ready to go on, you know what I'm saying? And I'm like, that's cool, you know what I'm saying? Like, I paid you, so, you know, I wasn't tripping on that, but the but the Had part, you been out there already a long time? No, nah, no, nah, what you mean, like? Like performing. performing. Had you been out I mean, there nah, for a long uh, time? Nah, I, mean, I had, so, I had I mean, got, songs that you it did, was, No, it was, it was time to go. Oh, no, okay. it was time to <laughs> so motherfucking it was, go. So it was time to go. But even in the middle of your song, so did the DJ or whoever. So I'm a, so, the music? I'm a, so I'm a, I'm a, so before leading up to that, you got it was already kind of. I got there like about twelve twenty. Okay. So I got there late. You know what I'm saying? It was already a monster, a fool. So it was already kind of chaotic. So I didn't see the angry face. I didn't know a nothing. Yeah, man, you were looking the other way. Anyway. I mean, his guy was already was already talking, and, and we coordinated. So I walked him in and put him with my guy, who I was like, "Hey, they handling the they handling the show for me. For, so they go get y'all right, whatever y'all need." So you know, I really didn't know what was going on. So before then, it had to be something going on, and what I was 
was told, you know, he was like, bro, man, they didn't have the back end all the way together. You know, we had to count the money outside in the car. He didn't want to walk through the crowd. So it was a whole lot of stuff that led up before we even got to the mm, stage so that he, had him already, you know, he like he, 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 we, he had wanted a section and I'm like, you know, there was, it was a miss, you know, communication mm -hmm. on the section because, you know, we didn't know that he want it wasn't a part of the rider. We didn't know that he wanted a section until he got there. Yeah. Okay. yeah. So they pulled up and, you know, then he like, hey, I want a section, but we, you know, we it's, selling it's, them bitches, right. you know what I'm saying? But my guy had put one aside and I guess it just went crazy. He didn't want to come through the, the front door because it, it was packed, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, it, it ain't no back door, you know what I'm saying? So he got probably a little irritated and, you know, this and that. But far as with me, he don't even know me. I didn't know him. So what he's speaking on me, I feel like he would have said that just to anybody. He like, and I was just telling my guy, my guy that was the point man, like, you know, you just should have told little bro who was throwing the party. You know what I'm saying? Like, so he didn't it, throw you, it, he didn't he, know he you was probably thinking I'm a regular nigga who, oh, okay. who opening up and like, you know, he ain't even knowing the, 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 uh, the, the affiliation that I got going and who I am, you know what I'm saying? So he just on some shit. I got my back end. I ain't got no section. I ain't got no girls, no bottles. Let me just rap and go. And I'm like, you know, I can dig it, fam, but, you know, that was just a miscommunication on that part to where, you know, uh, he he went up there and he gave that, that energy to the to the people that came to pay and see him. It, you know, it wasn't nothing toward me. I'm, nigga, I'm looking at the crowd. I, you got your back end, I'm looking at my back end. You know what I'm yeah, talking about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm really not even tripping, you know what I'm saying? But what I was told, what led up to it, because I called my guy, I was like, hey, man, you know, we talk like bosses. We don't. We don't go back and forth on no internet. We don't. I don't do that. You know, I'm gonna go. So you ahead. spoke to him since no, all I spoke of to. I spoke to the people that's over him. Oh, you know, okay. I talked to Junior. Okay. You no, know, nah, me and Junior got on the phone because Junior and his daddy they fuck. They got respect right. for me, so I know that they build off respect. So you know, me and Junior talked on the phone because he like, nah, bro. You know, whoopty woop, whoopty woop, man. You know, he wanna. He want He didn't even know that that was you or that you know that it was your party or that you brought him and this and that. He just thought you were probably one of them niggas up there just rapping. One of them niggas open up because what they trying to do is just have cut up and op cut the opening acts from doing his in his shows because he want to just get up there and rap type shit you know what i'm saying so you know me and junior rap you know like some you know like some real gentlemen supposed to you know what i'm saying and you know and and then you know he was just like you know he would you know he wasn't he, he wasn't on none of that you know what i'm saying he just didn't know who you was and and it was just really from the mean mug and i hate to just say it i'm like he made the he made the people in the country look like nah you don't want to fuck with us you know what i'm saying because he was mugging but you know it was just some other shit that went on in the world I didn't know so you know that was his reason for him looking all funny looking and now as far as him saying cut that shit off you know I mean I ain't tripping on that shit yeah, you know like he you don't know, really know yeah, you yeah, yeah he don't know and if, you know and if he don't dig it and this you know but I don't think he was nothing to it it was more or less on some you know he frustrated cause he ain't get having it his way no section no bottles he wants to sit and talk have some girls some honeys come around we didn't oblige him no, because I remember when I first saw it, I thought it was disrespectful because in, in my mind, I'm like, if you're putting it on and then he said, cut it, whoever the DJs or whatever should have been like, no, you know, the only person that could tell me something like that is you or whoever else above him, not him, because he wouldn't have the authority to do something like that. Oh, my DJ didn't cut it until I was like, Let, let's go. I mean, oh, like, okay, okay. That's what I wasn't I sure. Mean, I wasn't sure about. It. I wasn't sure if it, everybody on my end already know what the play is. I like, no, nah, I paid you to come perform. This shit wasn't. It was my party. Okay. So, you know, when you was ready, you know, that's when he hit the stage. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Once he got his money together, it was like, shit, come on, let's go. Because honestly, probably the 30, 40 minutes before, it was a fight broke out. So a really? hundred people kind of left. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So it slowed the time down. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, at the end of the day, you know, he did what, you know, and then he didn't do nothing like three, four joints. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, you know, I didn't know, you know, like, like it was a, you know, he had a, you know, a problem because I was like, shit, he would go come in and rap. He got his back in. He good. All the stuff that I saw yesterday, right. I didn't know that that was going on that night. You know what I'm saying? Like, I didn't know that it was an issue. Mm -hmm. So, you know, I was just pretty much just partying and enjoying myself. So I seen all the hula later. Right, do, do you think that, do you think that, um, do you think out of town uh, people respect these, you know, Texas when they come to this? Um, I know they don't. No, it, I know they don't. 
I mean, because we've been aligned, not just, not, not, we gonna say Dallas. Now, yeah, yeah, Dallas. Because the we H-Town Dallas. boys, have, they got their order. You hear me like yeah. shit. You know, and that's just the difference between Dallas and, 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 and Houston. You know what I'm saying? D- Dallas ain't got no one face. You know, his bosses all across this joker, but H-Town had, had one face. You know what I'm saying? Which is Jay Prince. You know what I'm saying? Dallas ain't got no one face. You ain't gonna have no one face in Dallas. It ain't nobody running the D. When, when you look at it, uh, there were some things that came out on Facebook today where they, they say that it's uh, it was uh, trolling, but there's been some live footage of uh, Finesse Two Times on that Facebook page. It was some, like he double, like it was a statement, I'm riding through Texas, like I'm Emmett Smith, some different things where it was uh, seemed to be geared towards you. Um, when you how when you see the, or when you hear these type of things, what do you think? I mean, once again, I don't be moved off of words, you know. And just like I just said, you know, I go over the head like I ain't never met, bro. I'm gonna go over the people who I'm gonna go to the person that's over because that's who I got a relationship with. So once we once we congregate and have, I sit down like gentlemen and get an understanding. Anything else under that becomes obsolete. Yeah, it yeah. becomes non voided because, like, shit, I don't have to say nothing because it's already overstood with the ones that's over. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I don't even have to come on. It's like, you know, they. I mean, he said it was a troll, so we really don't even have to talk no more in a sense of, like, like what happened because, I mean, now it took, it took I, I appreciate my people riding for me, though. You know what I'm saying? They just let me know, like, man, they tired of them boys goddamn be trying to throw, throw, throw dirt on the done and even just disrespect the city who, of, of a person who represents the city. So just to know my city is around and, like, riding with a nigga like that from, you know, East Texas all the way to DLW, like, that's hard, you know? I'm saying, but you know, we wrap the taste that it, you know. I talk, you know, we talk, we sit down, and homie. Let he was like, Man, that ain't me, you know. He like, Shit, I ain't, I ain't said nothing on Facebook today, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Who, who, like, the, the, he oh, told, you talked to him today, yeah. I talked to him and Junior. I ain't talked to him, I talked to Junior. You talked to Junior, yeah, I talked to Junior. Junior, was like, Shit, I'm with bro, we been on tour, you know what I'm saying? So, we doing the radio thing right now, you know. And I just told him, I say, Check this out, I ain't, I ain't tripping, but you know, bro, gotta be back down there, little bro, gotta be back down there in a couple weeks. In them same neck of the woods. Are you and, serious? Yeah, and I'm like, you know, just you know, be on on that because it ain't nothing with me. We groove it once we done had our conversation. It that shit, that that's buried. You know what I'm saying? That's nothing. But I know he coming back down there, and I'm knowing how them people in Texas is feeling down there in East Texas, and and what what vibe they on, and with him coming back down through there, and I fuck with you. I want you. I want you. I want your team to be straight. So you know, that's more or less what I'm talking about and, and telling him like we groove it, bro. Like you know, I ain't you know you like bro want to meet you. You know what I'm saying? That's that what he on he like bro wanna meet you and I'm like shit I ain't I ain't tripping I need to add you nigga yeah it's, it's really you know, like the just looking through all the dang text and like I said if it's trolling trolling like hell you know what I'm saying yeah 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 I mean nigga I, like, ain't trying to hear that everybody what is it everybody got a a, a, a background you ain't hear it's just a lot of old talk all that but at the end of the day all this stuff that that people do on this internet man I don't know whether real or fake. It seemed like they play too many games on this internet. Right, you know what right, I'm saying? Right, like, right. I understand why you say you live in the real world because a lot of this stuff, bro. Because I've been a victim of it. I understand people just go in and just do whatever because they feel people say a lot of stuff in a safe place. Right, right. They always do. That's the best part they can say it. <laughs> so, so <laughs> this is what it is with me with this with this social media shit. You know, I tell the person, man, I never be personal on her. Mm-hmm. I never be personal on her. I ain't gonna never even take nothing personal, my guy. Like everybody got an opinion on this boy, and I done learned how to respect it. Before I opened my mouth and said I'ma let these cameras get on me and I'ma talk, I said I'ma respect everybody's opinion and don't take nothing personal. You know what I mean? So I don't really be moved by the good or the bad. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Like shit, this all it can all be a facade. You know what I'm saying? But you know. uh the, the, this internet shit is crazy. Like, oh, it's like, very I crazy. mean, and when I looked at the footage, I was like, dang, they do look like misconcepted. Like, it look crazy. Like, like, like they did run a nigga off the stage and this and that. Listen, it looked like you let Dallas down. But I seen nah, that. I, I know, not Dallas. No, Dallas. No, 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 he was in these shit. No, no, I'm talking about how, how, how he put it. How, how they put out the other Right, right, yeah, the, yeah, the narrative, yeah, yeah. But, but then, you know, I'm like, you know, like, <laughs> how you, I'm, like, internet, I'm like, man, how you nigga go, nigga, this my show. 
in my money in this bitch, nigga. What y'all tripping on? I don't give a damn about rapping right now. Like, man, I'm getting the back end. Nigga, I'm back. I came out my back end song. Nigga, what the hell? So, you know, but 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 I get it though. You know, I get it, man. I get it. And I understand, like, that's just how people are, you know, like shit. That's just how the city is too. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, they'll talk about you, but when somebody else do something to you, they go ride yeah, with they you. They ride with you on that one. Yeah, yeah, fuck that. You can't talk about them, but we can. You know <laughs> what I'm saying? Yeah, that's family. That's yeah, family. Yeah, that's what yeah, family yeah, do, yeah, nigga. Yeah, 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 people yeah. In other states too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. After, so, after the show, uh, you did. You had a hell of a run over here. It opened everybody's eyes. I, when, when, you, when you left for the last time, um, Charleston came out with something saying you was broke. It, it was a couple of, uh, I seen a couple of times. He ain't, he ain't got no car. He lost his car. He yeah. owed me some money or whatever the case may be. He just kept, what yeah. was that all about? I mean, that's y'all got before. You met him before me. Yeah, I did meet him you before had you. You had dealing with him before me. Exactly. He cut loose on you before me. Way What's up more. with your guy? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you put it back on me. <laughs> you know, he was, he, he, you was his man once before. We right? had a good, we, had, we could have a hell of a conversation so about this. So it's yeah. like, we, he like, he just bumping and bu he's bumping and grinding on people, baby. He get he hit. Well, man, 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 you hear me? You know, been the internet hell, bro. You know? Like, and I can't be. Listen, <laughs> I don't. I don't need nobody. We don't know each other like That's that. The same thing. And it's like shit. I ain't tripping because, like, if I see, I, he, I don't know. We ain't into it. Like, I want to knock your head no. off. Like, so I mean, him getting on the, you know, on the internet doing what he do, like. Shit, he done did it to Nipsey. He done did it to so and so. Did to me. Did to everybody. Yeah, it's just like you know, he doing it to somebody that 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 work. He's close on, but he, only thing different is just like, nah, he was being cool with me. You know what I'm saying? We was, you know, it was just like shit. We were cool, 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 and then all of a sudden, you know, it's like he said something about him. Now I don't like him no more, and it's just like it just went real little kiddish. You did. I'm like, ah, <laughs> right, right, damn. Yeah, it, I was like, <laughs> I'm like, man, how it just go like that? Now you get it. <laughs> it got real little kitties, and I don't know how to entertain that. You know, so I just be quiet. You know well, what I'm saying? Sure I'm glad yeah, somebody else dealing yeah, with it. I don't know how to entertain it. You know, he just saying, you know, you want, he ain't saying nothing about, nothing I ain't said on the roof for us, you know, uh, the, the situation. But, you know, I get into that. Y'all just got to come watch the documentary when it come out. Oh, and they'll yeah. get the story. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, you know, I'm a street cat. So, you know, I got testimonies. You know, I'm not just a rapper. I'm not just a dude that you a fan of. I lived another life, too. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. and when you live that life, man, anybody that's, you know, living that, riding that lane, you know, nobody's exempt. The best of them done got touched on. You know what I'm saying? That's just a war wound, but I'm still here. That could have been 10 years later, nigga, who, you, it, it's some niggas who got, you know, didn't even got a chance to do what I'm doing right now. They like, boy, shit, boy, they out of there. Boy, you know yeah, me, you can talk up. about it, So, King. you know, that's cool, and, you know, as far as, like, you know, nigga, you, you, you see where he was doing his podcast, and he came up here and did one with you. That they was my, hard. My, that my, was my, my, go hard up here. This old go hard, nigga. Just saying, that my month sway though. You know what That's I'm saying? Right. And cooking, <laughs> you know, game related never had a podcast like that. And that's what he said it was, right? For the game related game. They ain't never had no look like that. So I was like, man, I can't I don't know how to even rebuttal to a lie. I think it's it, it's uh it's entertaining. It's real entertaining. But when you look at like a platform like this, you know, you look at how how we laid, you know what I'm saying? Having a great time, you know. Uh, this ain't you know this a little different than than your everyday run of the mill. We we right. really get down. You know right. what I'm saying. So when you get in a professional setting and you see it and you see the finishing touches, you know what you wrapped up in. Right. I just put I said like that. Nah, big it's fly as hell. You know what yeah. I'm saying. Yeah. Everybody loving it. The yeah. world speaking. Hey, what's nah, going on, man? Yes. I love it. I yes. got to fly in yes. and check that out. Blah yeah. blah blah. Everybody don't get that, my nigga. No, nah, no, nah, no, nah, big face. Nah, you 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 got an ambiance in here, man. Nah, care. it's a vibe. Like, nah, you playing music, you know, it's clean it. cut. You know yeah. what I'm talking about? It's yeah, it's groovy. So, you know, and that's 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 the kind of vibe I pro I try to present to I in my world, it, you know. So yeah, yeah. That man. for us by us, I tell everybody. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's for our people, man. Yeah, for sure. You know what I'm saying? That's the most important thing I could probably tell, you know, is when you come into something where you got brothers like you. Because I wouldn't be nothing without God. God first, I'll okay. say that. But but the people like you, 
like the uh, the Rose, right, right. the niggas who just came seamlessly. No, I ain't have nobody when you first came. Think about that. Right. That was I, matter of fact. I want to say that was it. I hadn't even met Charleston back then. That, you you did no. Okay, okay, bro. I didn't. I was brand new, right? Gotcha. We was new. Gotcha. We didn't. Gotcha. Gotcha. I only had you and Mike Jones. That was it. Gotcha. <laughs> so that was early on. You know what I'm saying? And and Duro. and it was just a few people that had been through here at that time. You know what I mean? Right. So I take it seriously that we got. A great platform here. Play music. You know, I've been yeah. killing you with the music. Yeah, yeah, I told you that. With, <laughs> yeah. yeah, keep it coming. <laughs> yeah, the world, nah, I, world. I'm gonna shoot you some shit. You yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna push it out there too. Yeah. I just enjoy the the movement. Um, love to get with good dude. Look how long we've been sitting there talking, having a good time. You know what I'm saying? Just kicking it. That's what it's about. And that's what a podcast is about, right? Yeah, it ain't nigga. I ain't here to down nobody. Not every time. No, not people. every time. No, no, you, not no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Nah, I mean, I ain't even feel. I don't got to step on. That. No, I don't got to step on you to put myself up, man. Not you know really. what I'm saying? So it's like, you know, boys who be campaigning that type of vibe. You know, they go eventually get elected, man. That's it. And you don't know when that election go come. But if you know, if they don't sold, they sold for the gold, then they gotta live with. You gotta live because, with that, man. You know, cause it's people that, that that people be like, especially with Helmy. You know, he he talk about people. It's people that love pe them people that he talking That's about. That's real. And they ain't gonna look at it. It's just like he an entertainer, he a, 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 a social media guy. Some people gonna take that shit to heart. Yeah, no, nah, that's real. They are. They are. <laughs> I know sound like yeah, they gonna take yeah, that to heart, yeah, and it's gonna yeah. be, and you know, and you can't just be out of sight, out of mind like that. Your bread ain't long enough. Mm -mm, mm -mm. You gotta come in the real world. Yeah, no, you know, that's, that's real talk. So that's why I always keep it like, you know, I'm a, I'm gonna do this shit in truth, like at least mine anyway, and and you could choose to rock it or knock it. It, it, it is what it is, but I'm not on here to do no that kind of entertainment. I'm trying to sell some music, try to you know get some good news they can use. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Shit talk. of that nature. But no, nah, I'm not here to bash nobody. I mean, I ain't gonna even bash him. Like he threw me an alley oop too. You know, me they, too. Nigga, nah, they I mean, got, I listen, was, man, I call hey, it investment. To be out. honest, which I invested, man. Bro. See, listen, I'm going to be so transparent with you. We knew this shit was going to happen, me and Charles. It just happened on another way. He said, man, I can't get him to fuck with him while they got down me. I'm riding with him. Let me must start talking about this nigga. He over there licking his chop because, you know, he playing his game. Yeah. Nah, yeah. he playing his game. I see him talking about travel. He turning us up. We just got to do what we doing now. You know, keep I ain't going to. I've been yeah, saying it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We just got to keep doing what we doing. I ain't getting caught up in the shenanigans. That's his platform nah, of people who, who, who liking the entertainment. And all they doing is come looking at us. Nah, nigga That's saying, real. man, Charleston, we're going off on you, but you coming to check me out, though, huh, man? <laughs> <laughs> That's some real talk, Yeah, bro. you coming to see what's up about me, man. So, you know, and, I ain't And get over there and like it, get caught up in the man, sauce, man. Right? they leaving comments, I'm going to start doing engagement back. Maybe if I start talking back to them, it'll get a little older. <laughs> they will? I do it. They will. Oh, that's what he do. He yeah, know yeah. for So, at the end of the day, I really, I really... Salute them Cause it's like shit they help e Even though It didn't go With us working together It came It still came The way we all We, we was talking all, yeah. When you was riding In my Maybach That got repoed You said When you that, It done came to fruition You know what I'm saying <laughs> <laughs> Shit we, I'm viral nigga <laughs> <laughs> So, they done put me in the mix. Uh, would you ever? Would you ever sit back down with uh, uh, Sean Cotton? He should have been done calling me. I ain't never been no cause. He he the one feel he too big. <laughs> he said he too big. <laughs> so, so, he post been done got me on there for he get a link you know, like he post been. You know how big that would be for y'all to do an interview he, right he, now. He post been when it happened. Yeah, That'll be huge. Been, he post been done call me right he, now. It'd be like now, nah, mm -hmm. yeah, because that'll be huge. Yeah, I, he think, been I, I think that'd be no a good look. I want to see what he want to talk because you know I know if all it, man I had it got ugly. You know if all the was like, oh, that geez. was you see my tip. It said got so, ugly. What did they say? What else did they? What did they say? What did they say the other day? Yesterday, like what you gonna do now, nigga? For Ness had said that you ain't gonna say nothing. You he ain't from North Arlington, nigga. <laughs> I said, nah, man. Say, when I put that on the 
that title. I knew. I knew right then. I said, I got him. This oh, nigga gonna cause some problems. Say. Say and, then, and then I was like, I done got a couple groovy cats from North Florida. So you hear me? <laughs> they like, nigga, we know what you on, OG. We ain't tripping. Man. That, nigga, that nigga from the east side, though. But you know what I said? I say, well, the east side would have got it, nigga. He said the north side. He, 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 nigga, y'all take that shit out on him. Man, I ain't gonna lie. I went back. I still, and, and I, I want to tell all my people I apologize. I'm very but I fuck with, listen, I'm fuck very with all romantic with that footage. I have not released your yeah, full fuck, interview. I, I, you I know that, right? I fuck with all the to all the way through and through, man. That was just a, and I had to tell a couple boys, like, man, quit putting on shoes that wasn't meant for you, fam. Don't be wearing that man's shoes. Bro, that was a good interview, dog. Yeah, they, they Boy, you interviewed like hell over here that say, night. Shit, you just shitting on the whole auditor, nigga. <laughs> Damn. I say, but I'm a West Dallas nigga. I say, check this out. How you niggas like North Arlington feel about us West Dallas nigga? I say, we the roguish, thuggish, crime, burglar, just <laughs> low down. Well, nigga, can't, I can't, I ain't gonna wear that jacket because somebody out of the West done got down before. That's it. That's it, man. I think a lot of times, man, it's just... You been around, man. Your legacy, man. You a legend, bro. I I can tell you this, man. I talk to niggas. Niggas say, man, they need to. Sh they really need to pay homage to a chief. That nigga legend. No, no, I'm telling you, this wasn't it. Shout out to LD three hundred. Show you right. That nigga told me that today. He said, man, they don't treat their legend right over there, man. Nah, that's what. Nah, I'm telling you. I don't, need, I don't be getting it, but it's like I'm not gonna get handled though. No, see, I'm not going without a fight. They about to feel me all the way across. I'm, this, I've been having to take mine. They ain't get the the city didn't give me nothing. I had to take this love. Now they don't want it. They ain't gonna let it go. No, they gonna ride with a nigga because the way I had to take it, I had to prove myself. I had to work real hard. I had to really pull up and be in boy's face. I had to wrap my ass off like Puka said. Like, nah, I really wrap my ass off, fam. Shout so, out Puka Lira, You know, man. like. You know, so you know, I know, I know that I'm, I'm some, you know, a, a major instrument right here when it comes to just the culture. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, don't get me wrong, it's other cats out here, but shit, it's only one chief though. Oh yeah, for it's sure. Only one, it's oh, you only one chief. To, you, I gotta say, you're a legend in the city, man. And and when you think about it, like it, you can't get around that. I don't care how they try to get around it. You put too much work in, man. Can't be overlooked. Can't be overlooked. I agree with that a hundred and uh, oh, hundred and twenty percent. I mean, cause all I be asking be like, shit. Tell me what they done did that I ain't did. Anybody that's here now, I mean, okay, we done hit records, singles, you know. But I can say a lot of shit that I done did that they ain't did. Now that's real. So Mo three, I, I think, I think a lot. Somebody said, was it that? Mo three ain't he didn't get to deal with his legacy or something is what I think it was Rain said that and he was insinuating that you you had alluded to that um, when it comes down to Mo three what because he was powerful in what he done in the time that he had to do it in of course he didn't get to finish it but he had a hell of a run right I, I didn't like I said I wasn't on him like that like this cat say that he was which right. he, he wasn't but. Uh, he say That's he was, <laughs> but right. anyway, uh, just his, le his being a legend. I'm gonna ask you this because you didn't answer this over and over again. Right. But being a legend uh, or, or or his legacy, how does that stand when it comes down to what he done with the time that he had allotted here in Dallas? I mean, he did what he did like some legendary shit. You know what I'm saying? Because I look at him the closest thing to what I was, what I did. You know what I'm saying? able to sell records. Now he went to go, he was able to get the best of both worlds because out of the new group of the artists that was out, he was selling records, albums, not singles, not, you know, he was actually, hey man, we 12 songs, 13, 14 songs. So, you know, on that alone, he 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 was setting himself apart just in this new jet wave of the, uh, of the Dallas rappers alone you know what I'm saying so I'm always respect that to the highest power because that's my game you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying so I'm gonna respect the one who can make them boy pay that ten dollars yes sir now if you making them boy pay that ten dollars I'm gonna respect that you know what I'm saying then you know with the transitioning over to the to the social media and the, the IG and the Instagram and this and that he he entertained the best out of all of them you know what I'm saying so when I speak on him it's like people want to like like They'll say I'm hating because I don't totally agree with what they agree what they saying. Mm -hmm. Oh, that he was the best thing since sliced bread. Like I like Jordan, but people may say Kobe or, or LeBron. Like, and I'm gonna be like, I fuck with them too, but they not Jordan. Yeah, yeah. But you can't say I'm hating just because 
I'm not agreeing the way you want me to agree with you. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Now you can't make me say because the way I look at a lady, I'm gonna be like, shit, they calling me a legend and I'm like, they ain't did the work I done did, so what's a legend then? Shit, like, mm-hmm. if I'm if I'm 15, like, it took me to get to 10, nine years to be, for them to be like, man, yeah, that nigga a legend. I ain't called me no legend in two years, three years, four years. Nah, I had to, man, I had to really put in some work. So it's like, you know, when people just, you know, using the word, I be like, man, what is the credentials, man? What is the criteria, what y'all call it? Because when I look at all the other people in the uh, the, the pearls in the game mentioning legends, it's it's a it's a lot of boxes that got to check out. You got to live. Mm-hmm. Now, you know, don't get me wrong. You got some that passes away or this and that, and they have you know they they be on the trajectory. They they go and tra- you know crown them. Hey, they a legend. Somewhat like how a lot of people I feel like with Mo. Like, don't get me wrong. I'm a realist, fam. He hadn't had a hit single yet. Still had. Outside was the Bobby Billions cat. So you know, like you know, it's it's a whole lot of things to help you know bring you into that to that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like you know, he had a movement like a motherfucker. He had all them hard joints, this and that, but he hadn't yet had a hit radio hit yet. So he he still wasn't even worldwide. He wasn't even national wide. You know, you got Yellow, he got national. He had exposure. a hit record, mm-hmm. national exposure. Tr- Mo was just. Underground, he was, you know, he was right. He was working himself, and he was gonna get there eventually. But he took my route, you know what I'm saying, down there. But in the, on the, on the core part. But once he got on the, they weren't out entertaining him on the on the social media. He was singing live and rapping and <clears throat> you know doing skits and everything. So he was playing the game. All he had to do was just put that money behind himself. Rain them doing all that bullshit. Y'all should have took some of that money. And put it behind one of them records, and then y'all wouldn't have even been worrying about yelling them. Wow, yeah, yeah, that was that that was. A I mean, hell of a movie little bro there. just should have just put some money behind him, and then you know the narrative probably would have been different because he had plenty of records. So it's like you know, I be a realist. I be like, little bro, didn't have no hit record yet. He yeah. ain't had no hit record yet. He wasn't he wasn't nationally exposed until the event happened. And I hate to be a, a person to say like it one they don't know more from the music, it's from the tragedy. Yeah. And then they dive the you know, the world started diving into the music, the rapper started giving him them alley oops, hey man, woo woo. They weren't doing that shit while he lied. They took that feature money and just waited on whatever to happen. I think him and when him and Boots and them hit it. They hit, a, was, they hit a groove spot at Boosie the end there. Boosie was fucking with him. Yeah, Boosie was fucking with him. Boosie yeah, was fucking with him. Was but good Boosie lift. wasn't. A, he wanted the Gates or uh, like the other folks who were giving them them alus like Gates shit with platinum with them. That's when all you know wait, is that the broken love, right? Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like him and Boosie was that's that's some street shit. Like street. he get the that's that street yeah. love. He just locked yeah. in. You know what I'm saying? That's what I like. So. <laughs> But, I ain't gonna lie, but I like that's that's a, I'm, did, a, I'm but, more of a street kid. But to get so, that to get that what that he exposure, got, that national exposure, he, what you talking about? That's what happened. He had with Gates and you know Bobby them that you know they put their money behind. Now what happened was they put their money behind that outside song. You see the difference? Yeah. Do you think? Would you ever be willing to work with Bobby Billy? I never met him. I say, would you be willing to work with him? I fuck with all mine. Listen, I fuck with the Those city, fam. Work with me, I remember you saying it. Yeah, I fuck with the city, bro. Them boys, you know, and I mean, they might be a little, you know, uh, you know, don't know how to approach or, or something like. I fuck with the city, fam. Like, nigga, that's what I did this shit for for them boys to be able to trampoline off of. I don't give a damn if we done met or not. You know, the reason these doors open is for one of the niggas, I'm one of them niggas. These doors open that they able to play this game. Yeah, he he did that outside song uh, with him and. Boy, that was a hell of a song, but then it, it came with a lot. It came with a lot after he passed after Mo three passed away. The city kinda wasn't, you know, the way he was talking coincided with the way Mo three, you know, uh, uh Man, the way that Rain and him linked it. Listen, was, it they was got, crazy. They gotta come I don't I mean listen. The city will the reading that song blue because the situation in the city will fuck with that song. If you ain't fucking with your city and you from that, man, you ain't finna be really be blowing up, man. You boy gotta come fuck with your hometown, man. And these boys are they the young bulls, they make so much bad energy and bad the where they can't even come fuck with their city. You know what I'm saying? You can't go to this side. You can't go to this side. So you limiting yourself. If you just go stay on the north, you go stay in the cliff, you go stay in the south. You can't come and captivate this boy. You can't do nothing. Well, how did how did you do it, Chief? I mean, I didn't. I wasn't raised on beef. You know, I really damn near had a lane to myself. 
But you how know? did how did you how did you keep that? How did you maintain it? I'm pretty sure some people pissed you off uh, coming up. I mean, how did you how did you maintain the 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 because that's another thing Rain said. Rain said Chief 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 didn't get in the beef. Chief said Chief said F them all. Shots. Yeah, I don't need you. <laughs> that's no, what he said. I'm serious. No, he did speak no, good about you. In yeah, that. cause I mess with little bro. He just be talking outside the next time. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm proud of him. Like I, t well, he just don't know how to embrace what it is I'm saying to him when I'm saying, "Hey, bro." Get off of that peon shit, man. Get on your big boy shit. Like, nigga, get, stop indulging into the bullshit, putting keys in the back. Nigga, you a manager. Go Like, he don't know how to embrace when I'm telling him these things. So I'm telling him that from a, 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 a place from the heart. You know what I'm saying? So I know he fuck with me. He just, uh, you know, he just said in his way how he think. And I mean, I respect it. You know what I'm saying? But like, nah, I just didn't do beef. Like, it wasn't no need, you know? And, and if it was, like, you know, she it was it was some other kind of folk with me. Yeah, yeah. I think that's I think that's what made made your legacy. That's what hell. That's what shows your legend too. I mean, a lot of times people say, "Well, he didn't do this for them, and he didn't do this for." But but let you ask, gave an example. Let, though. Wait, let me ask something. What did I supposed to actually be doing for people? <laughs> Yeah, I'm some rich nigga shit. Like, what did I what did I supposed to do? What like what you niggas want? Like, yeah. I wanted a pack, a car. <laughs> a chain Like what did I supposed to do Like nigga I'm in the projects what? Every day Rapping put, Popping the trunk Selling CDs And Big T You niggas didn't want to do that Boy don't Ain't it something else Like I'm trying to understand And I hear DJ Trap And I'm like Nigga what I supposed to do Like what y'all want He never did nothing for my crew What you want me to Treat you out to eat Man you niggas got the game Fucked up You know with me Like Like nigga I ain't never had no deal Y'all and that be the crazy part. They acting like I'm like, man, say, <laughs> man, before it was really goddamn me, uh, uh, uh little bro, Dolph. Nah, I was from the hip with the flip. Like everything they saw was it wasn't no deal. So the the, the city be treating me like I was a major. Nah, these boys be talking like I was a major just because of my lifestyle. And you know that ain't fair to a nigga because I'm like y'all tripping. Y'all put me in a position that I never had. Yeah, but that's that's because of how good you made it look. Right, nigga, right. They, right. And when I hear about Chief, it was the Bentley in the in the projects. Right. So, yeah, so nigga, you had a hell it. of a reputation in a time where niggas wasn't driving Bentleys at all. Right, right. You, right. Like you see what I'm saying? And these niggas, they wasn't used to that. And that, some of them won't admit it now. But I remember these conversations when it wasn't when everybody wasn't having uh, you know coops. You was having coops, and you was candy painting those. So that's a different level. And that's why I hold my nuts up, because that's why I talk my talk, you know what I'm saying? Because I know boys weren't doing that, but, you know, I'm just speaking on, because it's both loaded youngsters, too. Yeah, yeah. And, and the people who talk, it ain't the older cats who know, it's the youngsters. And, I'm, you know, like Dallas Globe, we be like, I be hearing about that shit, but I ain't see that shit, Chief. I said, damn, that's crazy, you know, because majority of all the youngsters is thinking like that. They ain't see Jordan, even though they wearing them J's. They, they like, we ain't see him. We seen LeBron, though. We seen Curry shoot that bitch from half court. Y'all talking about Jordan flying, but you got my rent flying through this bitch through the game. So that's this is a see me now game, and you know content. I, I did capture my life. You know what I'm saying? Man. So that's the documentary. You know what I'm saying? I was fortunate to capture my life. I didn't have a phone to go instant. I would have broke the internet a few times. No, oh, yeah, no, oh, most yeah, definitely. Yeah. Now nah, me and the e greedy, my nigga, we we wouldn't be having this conversation like this. It'd have been on some other shit. You know what I'm saying? Cause yeah, a nigga would have been been going viral. Yeah, yeah, no. Now nah, we been buying mama houses, been doing the the things that they you know capture. You know, now nah, nigga been doing those kind of you know, with the bows on. Yeah, man. Hey, mama, here you go. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you know, so, you know, I just couldn't capture it instantly so the world can see. Who is this nigga in the project? This nigga with all he goes on and chewing, stick in his mouth, waves going. Now nah, they seeing it now, though. And that's the intriguing part because they like, man, who is this nigga? Man, this nigga talking all sick. Nah, go check my resume. Go look at me. That's real. Yeah, go I, look at me. They're going to have a lot to, to search out, I can promise you, because you definitely got a lot yeah. that you did. You got a body of work that can't be denied. Yeah, and that's yeah. the cold part about Don Chief, nah, big, big Chief. Don Chief, Big Chief, man. Yeah. It's all in one. So I appreciate the love, man. Uh, nah, I appreciate the love appreciate that y'all always show you. Nah, like you say, you you gave me one. You and you and Big D, the ones gave me my first interviews. Everybody else <laughs> taking that. Now you know they. Hey man, when can I come sit down and get an interview? You know what I'm saying? I like man, I ain't tripping, fam. <laughs> 
Set it up. <laughs> nah, just thank you so much for coming. Since the last time you've been here, you have been seen a lot now. Man, yeah, you've done a lot, you man. Like everybody, but it was already, for me, I already knew. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, for them, do, but it's they, new they to them. They didn't see them. No, they but didn't they see him. See now, they, they know see you now. Cause one, one girl talked about his hair on on McCombs. No, they, they love your hair. They, they love hair. your hair, Mr. Damn Beat. <laughs> now that these niggas in these comments tripping, I'm up late at Sorry, night. What somebody the said he be going on that shirt shirt. <laughs> <laughs> I said, I said, damn, man, they don't care what they say, bro. They told me I had a thing on my head. You can say, you got a hot thing. I said, what the hell, man? Nigga said in one of them, he said, you know not to leave nigga with no waves going to the side. Only now nigga got waves, but them nigga be tripping on. But but that's that's the game now, man. We just got to turn it to our eye, for real. We got to make sure we capitalize on the time. God ain't going to let you plant no seed and not be a harvest, bro. Nah, so at the end of the day, I think we, I think we're on our way. Nah, we it ain't no thing. We is. We just gotta keep moving. Gotta keep moving just and grow. Keep moving. So you know, I appreciate all the love, you know, and that's just like even me and Junior being able to talk. Now, I ain't been, now, I ain't been able to rap with little bro, but that's just another bridge that we just cross for us to sit down and congregate on some ball shit. Like nah, bro, nigga, I know who you is, nigga. Little bro don't even know how the relationship is between you and us. So like nah, let's get it, let's get it right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so. Yeah. Yeah. You know Who knows what's gonna happen I like that man I like the fact that Cause I'm trying I'd love to get Junior on the show The dad as well Right but, You know So that that's something That I, I work on But not really in no hurry Just working You gotta yeah, work yeah, you, yeah. you know how it is yeah, When you working sure. You don't I don't look at people I just be trying to work Cause I'm gonna make you feel me You know where I'm coming from Listen <laughs> Like nigga I I'm just, gonna work I nigga. just told you that That was my run Nah yeah. they didn't give me nothing Nah, boy, I used to frisbee my CDs out the motherfucking window. We don't want that shit. I stole Mr. E beats. <laughs> nah, I'm trying to rap hard than the bitch. Nah, but when I start putting up big four and big six hundreds, big S five fifties, and you know Range Rovers before they was cool, big H twos when they just came. Nah, boys was just buying just because they wanted to get close to the joint. Yeah, yeah. No, I remember the movie. Nah, I went to Ace Town Power Wall and they were like, damn, that nigga down here in that shit for real. Yeah. Nah, I'm no facade. You know what I'm saying? We still out here doing that. You know, I don't be, man, that, but that ain't nothing that when you used to it, that ain't stuff you harp about. So the game that they doing now, I mean, we don't, that's just something you go get if you fuck with me, you just go see my lifestyle. Like, that ain't nothing that a nigga goddamn me put the camera. I mean, maybe when I was younger, but as a grown man, that ain't what you finna get. When that music coming, man? Now, I can't wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, man. you and Finesse, maybe we can get finesse two times man, on something with you. Man, say who's that'll who, be dope. No, nah, you know, like listen, we who knows what may shake. Cause the conversation being had. Yeah, no, nah, we groovy. Nah, yeah. Listen, I mean, I mean, you know, as far as what done went out, you know, I'm just telling my people like we groovy, man. Like, you know, it ain't even nothing. We, you know, that ain't shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, but appreciate the city for picking up and just like, like, nah, let's let's talk about it. You know what I'm saying? And cause that just let me know, like, nah, they 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 back on the team. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, they back on the team. You know what I mean? So, you know, it's all good. Ain't know? it crazy how things be going on on the backside where people don't really understand even. That you and say Junior had a conversation. They don't understand. It ain't for you for right. them to understand. Right. But they don't care about that either. No, they want to hear. They, they want to see the. They want to see the rah rah. Yeah. But they ain't go. One thing they go finna learn. Done ain't gonna give them no rah rah. Uh, no, but you know, just uh, all I can say is, man. Um, Appreciate you, man. Big love, man. I know already you holding Dallas down. I know niggas might not want to hear that, but this nigga held us down for a long time and will continue to hold us down. For sure. You know what I'm saying? For sure. I just need some bullies to come play with me. <laughs> yeah, I need some bullies to, in the city to come play with me. It ain't eyeball, it's wee ball. You know what I mean? I speak fluent in French. Wee oui, wee. Oui. Man, you know, to, to, to have songs with Rick Ross, to have songs with Jim Jones, to have songs with just a litany of people, Kiki, and you know the list goes on on and on and on but just just to be done did the body of work that you done and then people to be ah oh, we don't we don't know the, the old nigga old head really really supposed to know so they usually do know you know what i'm saying to be the young one that don't really know they don't know uh mr e they don't know nothing really yeah, nah, about boy, what the way it was we you got know? movies under our belts like that's independent coming from the hip man that's big coming from the city you know what i'm talking about now 2014 nigga was on billboards around yeah this motherfucker. yeah you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. nigga was 
you know, doing shit that, you know, like, boy, a lot of folk ain't did. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, you know, I'm also here to just get an education. You know what I'm saying? Just educate and give them the history because they seem to, you know, they don't know or they just forgetting. Man, man, thank you so much for coming on the show, man. And if you, hey, how can people get a hold of y'all? Once gotta again, say that. matter of fact, you know, we got to plug in. We will be getting ready to do some filming. So, but if y'all ain't got the episodes, go to Dunn Chief YouTube for the E Greedy episode, E Greedy TV episodes, yeah. along yeah. with the new music, along with, you know, uh, studio sessions and, and everything. But, you know, right now, Dunn Chief YouTube is where we at, you know, uh, official Dunn Chief on IG. And uh, you know, just stay tuned in. I'm, 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 I'm. I'm Earth, my turf. They got me floating around. So y'all go get a lot of shit. The documentary, can't wait. yeah, the documentary on the way. You know what I'm saying? Not just my personal, but once again, the other side of the DFW documentary too. So you know, I done got DOC. P I'm gonna get yourself. You know, and you know, I just got a lot of work. Yeah, but that music know. on the way. Shout out to my my other guys, J Rock, my little bro, Foreign Freddy. Uh. Uh, Lil G, JJ, you know what I'm talking about? Like, I got projects coming, LT, you know what I'm saying? Suave, you know, like, you know, just the, just the people that I've been doing a little body work, all the young bulls out there in the city. X the plug, I, I like them. Yeah, boys. I, yeah I like it. I, I, I listen to them, you know, uh, Lil Kevon, you know, I fuck with them, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. you know, Lil AK, Lil, Lil Zillionaire though, like, yeah, yeah. We got, we got some young bulls here, they just need to see that red a little bit so they can go at it. Yeah, 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 man. I, I see, I see some great things coming out of out, out of Dallas. If long as they, long as they keep the eye on the prize, you know what I'm saying. Learn, learn that respect structure. It's up from. And there. that's why a nigga keep spitting that game that you know, cause they tuned in, and I, you know, I know it's a, a certain way to reach them, and this is it. You know what I'm saying? For sure. Yeah, this is it. Man, check it, man. Hey, man, it's been another great segment of Boss Talk 101. What a bosses talk. Boss.